A local school district is continuing to work on helping prevent drivers from speeding in school zones. News 5's Andrew McClung learns how technology has helped drop numbers drastically in Smith County. Along Lee Highway right beside Atkins Elementary School in Smith County. Principal Gary Roberts says speeding has been an issue for quite some time. Throughout the, my tenure here, we've had a lot of trouble with cars just going really fast through here. A couple years ago, they had a bad accident out here that cost someone their life. And we did have an incident where a teacher was almost struck by a snow plow. All these issues got Smith County leaders talking about what they could do to find a solution. Leading to speed cameras being put in at all Smith County schools back in September. Our goal was to get to, to zero speeding infractions. I mean, our goal is to get to that point, but this has certainly helped us uh, negate the issue of speeding through our school zone. Smith County Superintendent Dennis Carter says the cameras are only on from 7.30 a.m. to 8.30 a.m. and from 2.30 p.m. to 4.30 p.m. when students are in the building. I do bus duty every morning. I can watch how much of a difference and impact it's had. At this particular school at Atkins Elementary, we have actually saw the daily number of violations decrease month after month uh, to the point that we are now seeing less than half of the violations we were uh, in our first month. Sergeant Michael Lowe and Smith County Sheriff Chip Schuler say it catches all speeders. So even if I put a patrolman here to, to do radar, by the time he stops a car, comes back, does his uh, citation and goes back, uh, you've lost probably 30 more vehicles going through the school zone at, uh, at more a higher rate of speed than they should. Parents I spoke with say it's been a big help when it comes to student safety. People do slow down and it makes it easier to get in and out of the parking lot. It is certainly a way to help us uh, limit that speeding through our speed zones and, and address the safety for our students and staff. It's all about the protection of the children and the people at work here. Again, uh, what, what price tag do you put on the, the life of a child? Uh, if it saves one, you know, in my, in my career is worth every, every penny. In Smith County, Andrew McClung, News 5, WCYB. School leaders say all money from speed camera tickets goes right back to the school system, which helps pay for the school safety program with the sheriff's office.